Ham Radio. Hey, good evening everybody, it's Freddie Mac, and I'm back with another video. Nice, short, and sweet. And guess what? It's about All-Star. <laughs> yeah, there's plenty of them to come. There's so many things you can do. I just want to be able to show everybody how to do them all. I just thought I'd jump on here and see if you guys would like to schedule your All-Star node to reboot on a schedule. You know, when the, any computer sits long enough, it's liable to pick up a glitch here and there. And if you're not always there or in reach of it to get it straightened out, maybe a reboot will work. So I've got mine set to reboot every night around 2.30 a.m. It's not doing nothing else. Hey, just reboot. And you don't have to set it for every night. You can set it on a nice schedule to reboot like once a week, once a month, whenever you want to. My node is set to reconnect to its db switch bridge and to one other node upon reboot which is another video that probably will air before this one does or just after so i'll let it be a surprise so the first thing you want to do you want to ssh right into your all-star node and guess what yeah you guessed it we're going right down to number nine and we're going to start a bash shell interface we do this little step in the cron tab. Cron tab is the scheduler for all of your Raspberry Pi, all of your operating system in your Hamvoip software. So let's go to, let's type in cron tab space dash E. It's a nice little trigger for edit, hit enter. And there is your cron tab. And the best thing to do is just to go right down the very first available line but what are we going to type there well we know what we want so let's say hypothetically we want our node to reboot at 2 30 a.m every tuesday night once a week and i i can tell you what to type here but i want to give you a little tip also about crontab guru crontab.guru that is a cool little site to help you build your crontab entries let me just start this out. Okay. If you do five stars, that's every minute. We don't want this thing to reboot every minute because it takes it longer than a minute to reboot. The first set of, uh, the first star variable is the minute of the time. So we, we wanted to go 2.30, so we're gonna put in 30. And then next one is the hour, and I like to put in 0.2. Of the day of the month? Nope. What month? Nope. We're going to go day of the week, and I believe Tuesday is... Nope. Two for Tuesday. So that's the uh, scheduling increments that we want to use for our cron tab entry. So let's go back to cron tab and type in 30 space 02 space star space star space 2. Did that match what we had? It certainly does. So we're going to do a space after that, and we're going to type in this command line, forward slash ETC, or Etsy, forward slash, and the word reboot. And ladies and gentlemen, that's all there is to it. We're going to control X, yes to save, and enter to exit. Now, once you've exited and it's installed the new cron tab right then, you don't have to reboot. This entry into your cron tab is now active. But I'm a little OCD. And that's just the way I am. So I like to just do one of these numbers. Boom. And now my node is rebooting. Six, eight, dot, one, dot, two, zero, five. Node, five, seven. Eight four one connected to node five seven six three. And that's three, my macros three. on reboot reconnecting a couple of nodes. Node two seven two two five connected to node five seven six three three three. I made some changes to this the other night, and I should have changed them back once I was done making the video. When this node reboots, it was set to reconnect with the WA3DSP hub out of Philadelphia, 
and uh, 57841, the Alpha Alpha 5 Papa Delta personal node in Shawnee, Oklahoma. So I'm going to disconnect this one. Disconnected. And I'm going to go ahead and disconnect James for the sakes of this video because I've already got him connected to another node. Node 57841. And I tell you folks, that's all there is to it. Scheduling your node to reboot regularly is just that easy. And can be very beneficial to the constant operation of your node. So take a look at all my All-Star videos. There's plenty more you can do with All-Star add-ons and automation and all kinds of stuff. So this is Freddie Mac, your ham radio crusader, wishing all the good signals to be yours. Saying 73s from KD5 FMU and ham on y'all.